Hi, I'm Leland Worden. I'm the Director of Science at Plan for the Planet. And today we're going to be going to one of our restoration sites. Um, and I'm going to show you how we use drones for monitoring um, all of our work that we do there. So we use uh, drones to collect imagery of all of our sites and um, America 7, and basically what we're doing is collecting uh, photos so we can make ortho imagery of all of our sites that we can use for baseline, um, basically to understand all the vegetation status at the area, um, and then also to basically plan our future restoration efforts. So this is America 7, a site that covers about over a thousand hectares. And this site about 20 years ago was deforested, mostly for cattle grazing. So what we're doing here is coming in and trying to do tree planting to restore native ecosystems. And in total, we planted over this area about 1.6 million trees total last year. We found that drones are a perfect tool for monitoring our plantings as they grow over time. So SightScan has been a really incredible tool for our work because we use it to create ortho mosaics after all of our flights. And essentially, it's really great because it's cloud-based and we have limited bandwidth here. So we upload all of our photos to the cloud, everything is processed, and then we can download all of our ortho photos and point clouds um, and then use it for further data processing. Plan for the Planet has just developed a new collaboration with a reserve around here called Balanku, and this is a pretty incredible dry forest reserve in the area that they've actually observed jaguars and lots of other wildlife, but unfortunately there's a lot of illegal logging there. So what we're actually doing is going to help them to create ortho mosaics so we can try to detect illegal logging and then actually use that for enforcement in the park. So SightScan has been a really great tool for us, and we really think it could be helpful for other conservation organizations doing vegetation monitoring.